We're out in the water at the moment. It's been horrible. We've had rain for weeks. The water's pretty dirty. So I'm going to run one rod with pilchard, another rod with a soft plastic. Dead stick them both. And um, I'm going to do a dead stick soft plastic versus pilchard challenge today. See so how we go. Not overly confident the water is full of fresh water and stuff, but then again, you might get something as big as the boat. So the plastic I'm using, of course, is my old faithful friend, uh, Curly Tail Z-Man Grub. It's in the watermelon colour. Bit of um, S Factor. Seems to help. And, uh, The back, the other side, and we're drifting with the wind and the tide. So the drag is kind of loose because it's only, only three pound line. Got that in the uh, rod holder. So we'll see how that one goes. So I stopped in at my uh, local servo. And, uh, this is what I very rarely do. I've been only doing it lately because of the, the weather. I haven't done any good anyway doing it. I've got some pilchards. So I'm gonna cut that little pillion home and uh, stick it on the other rod. There we go, I've got the um, surrounding sinker. The size, whatever hook like that, man. I'm not good at that stuff. Doesn't really matter. The pilchard head, I'll top half the pilchard, stick that on there, a little bit of a half hitch around the head so it doesn't fall off in a hurry, and um, cast this out the back and put it in the other rod holder, and we'll see how we go. Absolutely hazing down off the coast, I hope it doesn't come this way. Must have had a bite in the bait, pulled it in, checked it, gone. So I'm putting this piece of bait on. So there you go, it's already doing better than I did the other day. Okay, just move spots. It's uh, just not drifting at all there. Much better lo location here, I think. Just uh, drifting down the main edge of the channel. Just the soft plastic on this one. Pilted on that one. I did lose a bit of pilted up there. Might have been a crab. No, no. I didn't see the bite. Didn't hear a bite. Didn't. Nothing happened. On the exciting scale. So, um, yeah, at least now I'm drifting. Well, that's the problem with fishing light. On the soft plastic. I don't think it's very big for the fish. Has it not woken up yet? It might be alright. I don't know what it is. Three, three kilo line, I'll just get a line on it. I don't think it's a surface. What is it? Oh, yeah, it's a nice bloody. Let me, let me use a little 
little flat fish. Yeah. That's something. There he is. Nice little flathead. Probably legal, but uh his lucky day. You you little curly tail. Z man. One eighth of an ounce jig head. A little bit of S factor. I don't know. It just works. Flathead like it. An absolutely stunning morning out here. A little bit windy when I got here, but pretty good. Certainly beats working. Although I do love my job. Alright, let's get that back out there. So far, soft plastic. Um, in the lead. Alright, be surprised if it stays that way. Stinky bait. Not a big fan. Sorry about the fish. On the uh, soft plastic. Yep. Any little flat head, I think. Yeah, teeny tiny. But still, shake it free. Shake it. Here he is. Hey, little fella. Teeny tiny little tucker. These are the buggers that really tend to. Uh, Cause the most amount of pain at times. He's only tiny. Look, there he is. Hello. Go get your mum. So plastic two eight nil. Bit more S factor. Now to get another tube of that. There you go. Soft plastics are winning. I hooked something on the back rod. It was quite big actually. Sort of his head shaking. Might be a really big flat head. <laughs> Pretty exciting. Bugger, but he took off.
for the one. Three, nil. Soft plastic, over bait. Here's, this one's probably not quite legal, but they're all going back today anyway. Here's it. Bloody bait lines, I have not. What was that? Oh my god. What was that? I hit a pole. Smash into the pole. That didn't hurt much. Where'd that come from? Anyway, Grunter. There we go, grunt, 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 grunt. Oh. Smashed into the pole. Oh. Wow, that is not good. Yeah, mate. Best mate Dan wanted me bait on, he's giving me the best help ever. He's in Stone Cane and we're fishing. He's helped me get the bait on. Um, bring me an ambulance, so we get the bait put away, I'll get all the valuables off it. And um, yeah, the ambulance come and sort me out. I've uh, fallen over and really done myself a uh, mischief. So this isn't how I expected the day to go. You know, in the um, hospital, a couple of foot pretty bad. Was, um, I was getting in the ambulance, started squirting blood everywhere. It was pretty good. What's well, X-ray done? So I'm in a different room now, and they're gonna look at it, see what happens. Fishing knots while you're at it. Yeah. You're doing the FT knot, are you? Or? <laughs> That's the strongest knot, apparently. It's more of a blood knot. Plenty. Blood knot, half inch. <laughs> Granny knot. Slip knots. No, they say if you can't tie knots, tie lots. <laughs> 